beyond compare and unconditional. I'm not that smart. Can you like something a lot? Kind of. Sure. Can you feel strongly towards something or someone? By being there for, for whoever you love, no matter what happens. I would define love as a pure heart and a loving family and a loving wife. Love is just a word until somebody comes like to you and like comes across and like uh, uh, and like makes the word of you like Jesus. It is like when you do something for someone and they you don't expect anything back. Passionate. Someone lays down everything. Yeah. It's me and Brittany. Yeah. Love is a great power that only one person can give us. That's Jesus. Like your favorite food if you like pizza or something. Like you really like that more than anything. That's love. To just find someone who you feel you can be compatible with. That's what I think love is. The person that you want to be with. What? Who you really care about. Friends. I have to identify love. When you die for someone. No, I'm not for sure. Love is patient. Love is kind. It's not envy. It is not boast. It is not proud. It's not rude. It's not self-seeking. It's not easily angered. It keeps no record of wrong. Caring for people. Yeah. <laughs> like camp brawlers. First Corinthians 13. Respect uh, and a passion for someone. Honesty, care, being there for someone, and uh, really having that feeling in your heart. Uh, homemade cookies. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> God. Um, just when you care about someone immensely, do you do anything for them? You will do something for someone, and you know what? I really don't know what it is. Okay. Love for Jesus, I guess. You know. Yeah. Love for God. It's like awesome. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah. But I really oh. care about that, somebody. A passion for someone, I guess. Unconditional. Patient is kind. And my mom. God, I love God. Love.